Oh, look at this. Hello, Roger. Glad you're here. I think I've come to the right place. We are VCO. Okay, here we go. Dobra, wchodzę. Hello. Hi. I'm Roger. Oh, hi, Roger. Oh, hi. Hi. Have I come to the right place? Yeah. Okay. Hey. Come on. Oh, Hello. Nice to meet you guys. Nice to see you. <laughs> hi. Oh my God. I'm happy you're here. So. Yeah. I'll show you around. Let's okay, have a let's you. have a look. Thank you. Okay. Hello people, this is Forty Splish Splash and finally I'm here to do my vlog. You might say, when it comes to my visit to Poland and Gdynia, visiting VR Visio, being invited there, I was there for two days and guys I had a blast meeting all these creative and fun people. Uh, sitting down, talking to them, learning about what they do, their interests and stuff, and also of course sharing you know, the same kind of passion and interests when it comes to gaming and VR and learning more about the actual technique behind working with VR. And also of course there are blends of people as I said doing different things when it comes to having a studio like this. Here we go down to the Green Cave and this is the place where I was spending most of my time with talented people that has worked in the business when it comes to film and such for quite a long time and you can really tell when I got in there I had a great feeling all from the start I felt I was in good hands and uh, I could just you know enjoy This is the headset you know so there's uh, me looking into it here and uh, so that's what I see and this is usually what people see when they watch VR. If I upload a video it's usually my perspective only. But now due to the camera and everything and this technique with a mixed reality kind of situation in the studio it's possible you know, to, to bring the viewer into the game which is a completely different experience. Uh, the best one I should say. I think that playing VR is a great experience and I hope guys you will have the opportunity to try it but I have to say you know doing it like this in a mixed reality studio uh, takes it like one step further uh, when you guys actually can see me in the game and be with me so to speak when I'm playing. Now this is a huge st step forward and for me it was a blast to try this and you know you start to think hmm how can I rebuild my house to actually do this at home. Not sure I will be able to do that. It's been a long day I woke up by 4 a.m. early morning then I came here to Gdynia. It's been a good day though. Uh, great people working at the VR Visio studio. They have taken so good care of me and we've been working hard. I have recorded a lot of stuff I will show you later. When I get home I have so much to edit. Some of the gameplay is just good as it is. So I will probably just put it up on my channel for you guys to see. So yeah, this is my room for now. It's it's good. I oh god, I, I smell bad. I <laughs> I look terrible. I'm tired. I gotta go and get a shower. Then I gotta hit the bed. I gotta sleep. And believe me, I gotta sleep really hard. Tomorrow is a new day. I'm gonna record a few more games. And I also gonna do an interview. Get a glimpse behind the scene, uh, how they're working, what they're doing, their plans for the future, etc. So. Stay tuned for that. Until tomorrow, take care guys. Bye. So after a good hotel breakfast, I was ready to go. I was picked up and we got back to the office and the localities of the Europeo. And guys, I'm showing you something that is pretty new and innovative. Let's take a look. So guys, this is really cool. I'm standing here at something called Arena VR, which is a really new feature here at VR Visio, something they're working on. And I'm one of the first people trying it. And I think it's really, really cool. Playing also their new game, uh, uh, Drone Hunter VR, in this kind of setting. Now, uh, this is not yet for the public, but if you guys are interested, always feel free to contact these guys. They're really nice and they're doing a great job here, so VR Visio. And also, I think you should know that I predict or feel that this is definitely something for the upcoming future when it comes to like the general public to try VR and have a nice experience, not only for themselves playing the game, but also for people you know, passing by and watching and see how VR can be like to, to play and to experience. Uh, so look out for this. Arena VR is something that I think is gonna be awesome. Uh, and again, it's a new technique kind of thing and I am very happy to try it. So it's Google's on and get ready to play. And again, this is Drone Hunter VR that I have been playing on my channel already. If you want to check it out, go and do that. Uh, at this time, they were also live streaming on their Facebook page. So we took advantage of that. 
and it was really nice. Again, some of these games are quite physical and I had a bunch of t-shirts that I tried to change as often as I could. Now, the rest of the games uh, were quite a lot of titles that I haven't played before, which was a lot of fun. And again, those would come up later on my channel. I love roller coasters. Oh my god. I'm a bit afraid of heights though. So. Oh shit, this is so high. I, I gotta hold on to something. There are no go oh, oh shit, I'm going down now. Oh my god. Oh, this is awesome! Wow! Oh, it feels like we're flying! Oh! Back on track! This is dangerous for the heart. Oh my god! Okay. It was a short experience for you. That was great! That was really nice. This is great, of course, because it adds that kind of extra feeling of, of reality, you know, when you feel the wind coming and, of course, the share moving and stuff. So, oh, great fun, great fun. <laughs> Thumbs up. <laughs> and here we plan to introduce some educational content as well, perhaps, okay. like a journey inside of, you know, the Earth or journey in, oh. into the cosmos or something like that. Yes. So this will be cool. And then we can have uh, uh, a recurrent events, for example, for like schools, for classes or just for groups of friends that we have, for example, on our mailing list, and then we can email like email them saying, you know, this month we will give you a journey inside of the planet, you know, planets or whatever. Yes. So then they can uh, have some uh, s new uh, cyclical content mm -hmm. that will be, you know, interesting for, for people. Definitely. So. After that beautiful arena VR experience uh, and also trying that roller coaster with a fan that was blowing wind into my face for a sweet experience and also the chair moving, it was time to sit down and also talk about some future ideas that might come up later. Uh, but I can't tell you really now what it's all about, but we'll see. But there were still a few hours left of the day, so we wanted to try to take advantage of that. And again, as I told earlier in this video, I would definitely try to do my best to edit those as well and put them up on my channel. I think it's great to to do this now when I actually had the experience to be here at uh, VR Visa Studio in Gdynia, Poland and try mixed gaming or mixed reality gaming for the first time. I had a blast again and uh, <laughs> this is the first game I tried out and this will come up also on my channel. Probably the first game I will upload or my first gameplay that you will see in a day or two. So with that said, I also was invited to do a interview because I think there are these guys are trying out to start a, also a YouTube channel and have like gaming news and a, like a show where the guests also get some challenges and that, that I definitely got and we had a great time. That was the end of the day. Hello, I'm Adam. Hello guys, I'm Fred. Welcome to the Green Cave Show. Yeah. <laughs> the first show ever actually. Yeah. We will explain to you a bit later why it's Green Cave Show. I hope they will proceed to uh, launch this Green Cave show and I wish them good luck with that and of course with everything else that VR Visa will do. But guys, it's time to wrap up and I'm gonna give you some last words from my trip to Poland. Hello guys, this is Forest Splish Splash. We're back in the hotel room here in Poland, Gdynia. And man, I'm quite exhausted, but also happy because this is uh, the end for now when it comes to my trip to Poland and Gdynia and to visiting the VR VCO studio. Now, I hope you enjoyed what you have been seeing. Let me know in the comment section. Give me some feedback. Gonna leave early tomorrow. Time to sleep. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.